Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Jade Falcon Freeborn. This is the true episode 118 for uh, Jade Falcon. I, For some reason I mislabeled the uh, um, Night Witches episode as Jade Falcon. I want to apologize for being away for a few days here. Um, it's been really hot up here and in the attic, um, so it's been difficult to, uh, to uh, record um, that. Plus I, I just needed a few days off. I needed to do a little bit of relaxing, was getting a little burnt out, so... Yeah, that's where that's been. So anyway, now that we're here, um, we have jump planets. We're at Organo right now. And let's have a quick look at the star map. And we are right here. Now this flashpoint is, I think that the, um, it's 33 days. Um, this is the one that we're going to take for our final episode. And what I'm going to do is... Um, I'm going to make the episode 120 the final episode for both um, Jade Falcon Freeborn and for Night Witches. Um, I think 120 is a nice round number to round it off at. Um, hopefully the uh, new version of Rogue Tech will be out soon. Um, but if it's not, you know, it'll give me a little time to take a break before we start into the new series. Um, like I said, I've already got it planned how we're going to do it. Um, it's going to be a clan-based start. We're going to have... Uh, two dropships attached to one Argo, which is basically two series running, but it's all going to be in the same episode. Um, so, yeah, we'll we'll just have to see how that kind of plays out. Anyway, uh, that being said, let's have a look at the mech bay real quick here. Uh, we've got a couple of good missions we can take here today, too. So, um, Timberwolf D is still down. The whole side's gone. I don't have um, patchwork materials in order to replace this stuff, so just going to leave it out of action. Um... But most everything else is back up, with the exception of the Exterminator, uh, which I was hoping would be back up today because we got a mission for these guys to take, but I think we can take the Mjolnir in um, rather than the Exterminator. I think it'll just be fine. Uh, either that or we, we take the new Catapult, uh, which has been outfitted. Uh, it's got four LRM-20s on it, mostly with Artemis, but it's also got Thunder ammo as well. Uh, it was designed for the second Lance to have a uh, missile support mech. So, yeah. Anyway, that's that. We I don't, I don't, we don't think we've ran this one yet, have we? I can't remember. It's been a few days anyway. So let's have a look here um, at the contracts. We have to choose our mechs wisely for this one. So we've got uh, Meat Grinder, a five skull mission against two elite pirate lances. So we're going to take that one today. And I haven't quite 100% decided whether we're going to take Letter of Mark, which most likely will be two uh, lances of reduced mechs, like reduced strength mechs. Um, but they're Comstar, so who knows what the, they could have half, half, half decent mechs. Or we could take Deniable Destruction. Um, once again, it's a Comstar base, so it's a destroy base mission. Most likely one Lance and turrets, so mm, they haven't quite decided which one yet. Uh, we might get reinforcements in this one. It is three and a half skulls, so maybe we'll take this one, but we'll see. That'll be the second Lance. So we're going to jump straight into uh, Meat Grinder. So um, let's negotiate this sucker. We're going to go full salvage, of course. And let's pull out these two. It's nice to be able to just run two pilots before. Uh, so Hannibal the Cannibal, uh, Mockingbird, um, Six Pack, and a Rhino. Let's bring them into play. And I think we're going to go with... Um, I'm going to give this one to Griff. I think, I think so. And then we'll use the King Crab on Mockingbird. I'm going to give the, where are you here, Longbow or the Jormungandir to uh, Rhino, and then Six Pack, um, what are we going to, let's, let's give you the Orion, let's give you the Shredder mech, you always like that, um, the uh, Ultra, so let's run with a pair of those, a pair of Six Packs, one on each arm, and uh, let's deploy and get this done. Ah, great. Isn't this wonderful train? Here we go. Yeah. So, the um, new series, we're going to do away with miss mission selection. Um, I'm going to run it much like I did my other series, um, where it's... Um, um, we just kind of come up with a storyline, and rather than, you know, being... Um, choosing random missions or whatever. We're going to be um, creating a story behind each of the missions to uh, work together 
as one big storyline. And we'll have goals and objectives. And the good thing about that too is because we're going to be having um, basically two games running at the same time. Ooh, you need more than a Raptor 2, guys. Because we're going to be having basically two games running at the same time. Uh, each Lance will have different objectives, obviously based on whatever missions we have with the planet. But we're going to work them together in some kind of... Um, um, storyline goal where um, whatever yeah I know where whatever missions they get we're, I'll work them in together into some kind of storyline so it looks like both lances are working towards a goal so that's going to be the uh, sort of the layout of the next series yeah what do we got over here black cat eh well this guy's made a mistake. Well, maybe not, because he's got, like, pretty damn good uh, evasion going on over there. What's going on with that? Mjolnir. A little better chance to hit than this guy. So, um, let's hammer him. I think we got the tag on. Yeah, we did. Good. Ooh, what else do we got over here? Eris, Grasshopper, Jenner. Yeah, it's supposed to be two elite lances. I don't see anything elite here. I was hoping for something better than this, but it's pirates, so... Yorman Gundir should be able to handle the whole left side by itself. Depending on where those guys move. Oh, man. Don't bother with missiles, guys. They ain't getting you anywhere. Should be able to pull that millionaire down this first turn. Uh, I don't want to direct line of sight. We're just going to move here. God, the arms in this thing. I wonder what it would like to, be to pilot this thing. It would be crazy, I think. Uh, let's... Start off here. Ooh, terrible chance to hit, but that's fine. Acknowledged. Enjoy the minefield, boys. Dire wolf. Hammer him. Come on, Griff. Really? Uh, Mark, Mockingbird will show you how to do it. This guy's all yours, girl. Ooh, terrible chance of the hit. Hmm, that's fine. Hoping to kill that guy this turn. I'm sure it's just because they have the height advantage, probably, on us. We're going to have to move up really fast, I think. We'll sprint in there next turn. Get close to these guys, shred them, and then uh, we'll worry about the guys on the other side if there's anybody left. Raptor 2x. Well, so much for moving quick. Yes, I'm kind of excited about the new series. I know I've said it multiple times, but I really am excited about it. I'm uh, totally excited about the uh, the new updates to Rotec. I'm glad they're taking their time, doing it right, um, getting all the new uh, mods in place. If you guys managed to go and check that video out on my channel, like I suggested suggested in the last episode uh, it's basically a helicopter um, demo video showing the uh, sort of proof of concept of how helicopter helicopters can work in the game I'm really hoping to get into uh, um, developing a way that we can get aerospace fighters in as well that would kind of be cool um, but I don't know how I don't know how that would really work out 
be kind of interesting though. Lots of evasion, maybe with like a handful of weapons or a few uh, bombs or something, which would be cool. Helicopters basically are going to be working the same way as vehicles, exception with the exception that I don't think it costs anything for train movement. Yep, thanks for showing up, guy. Yeah, so I'm looking for a few other series, hopefully, to do. Uh, I mean, that um, the new series will take a little bit of time. A um, little more time than just one episode a night. Probably like a couple of hours to do it. Because I'll have to run a mission for each each uh, lands and then it, put it all together in one video in the end. But, I mean, it'll be fine. I'll just plan things out planet by planet before we go ahead and do it. Okay. Uh, who do we want here? Let's let's change that. Who can we hit here? I want to come out of the. Uh, oh, we can hit this meal near. Let's do this. And let's hammer him. Okay. To start. Now yeah, we almost got the leg. Somebody got BPCs. Can we get to the side of this meal near? We can. Let's grind this guy up and finish him off if we can. Uh, here it comes. Reporting critical hit. Have a seat, buddy. Thanks for showing up. I think these guys are just going to stand on this hill. Fine by me. Let's pray on the weak. Let's go for the CT kill. See ya. Let's, yeah, the Jenner is kind of a good center, center target. So let's hammer him. Enjoy those minefields. That area is going to be so full of mines that when they decide to move in, they're done. God, two Raptors and a Griffin against 300 ton max. What are they going to do? Or, oh, sorry, 200 tons and a 75. I mean, the logical choice is a retreat, right? But that can't happen. You guys are in trouble. Hey, nice shot. Not that we're actually that evasive anyway, so... Enjoy it while you can. And you didn't move. Wow, he decided to commit suicide. I don't know why they do that. Maybe because they're right on the borderline of overheating or something and don't want to move and overheat. But you'd think it would be better for them to jump away. Because now he's dead meat. 
Anyway. Yeah, so I'm looking for other potential games to, to uh, do on my series. I know I, I did uh, Seven Days to Die. I'm still going to do another series on that. And the one that I've got going is... Um, I'm going to continue along with that because I kind of play it in my spare time. Um, so I'll probably get another one of those going. I know, it wasn't, I know it wasn't really that popular, but I'm having a lot of good time playing it, so I'll just keep doing that too. But uh, i got to finish off my uh, Minecraft Invasion series too at some point. Um, hopefully I can do that this weekend. Pretty much took last weekend off. Um, as I said, I'm just kind of getting a little burnt out here. And it's not just it's not just uh, this. It's um, also at work too, right? So I've been a little tired. All right, let's hammer this guy. He <laughs> missed with the tag. How do we do though? Well, he's unstable. Maybe the king crab can finish him off. Whoop! See ya. <laughs> that was the Jenner. Thanks for showing up. And let's just warlord this. Might as well. Firing. Whoop. Still alive, but not for long. He's backing up. I wonder where that black hat went to. Standing by. All right, finish this guy off. Wow, it took all three of us to kill this guy. I need a new target. Seven of eight health. I'm gonna warlord this one, give it a bit better chance to hit. Don't need to move. Oh, somebody's coming in for a melee attack. I don't know why, but whatever. 22 points. Oh, T Sam. Ow. You watch your heat. I'm not your pilot. I'm not the pilot. Okay, black cat. There he is. Good to go. Um. Yeah, I don't think we need to push this. I mean, we could, but what's the point? Just hammer this guy. I'm like hitting for half damage on these guys. Yeah, just shoot him. Guys are taking punishment, but they're not dying. Commander? Really? There you go. Full speed. No target. Um can we use anything? Either an LRM-15 or Ultra-5. Let's use an Ultra-5. Whoops. What's 
Hey, why can't we attack that guy? I can see him. Um, what? Sure, cheater, whatever. That was bizarre. Now he disappeared. Yeah, I guess probably he probably couldn't see him, but these guys could. I don't know. Whatever. Another melee attack. Warning. Minimal damage. His name is Taserface. Guys are losing their legs. It's a good thing we don't have to clean up these minefields. I watched a video uh, from Mark Felton Productions about um, a German uh, POW unit that was formed after the war to clear, clear mines in Denmark. What a horrible job that was. Yeah, sure. Hope we can salvage that. Does it really matter? Does it really matter if we can salvage it or not? I don't think it matters. Enjoy those minefields, buddy. Standing by. Rolling. Okay, what's our heat like now? Let's just go with these guys, because we're not going to hit with much else. Yeah, we got one hit on them. Nice. Standing. See if you can see those other guys. There we go. Target the black cat this time. Mm, let's leave these off though. Yeah, might as well. Yeah. That's gonna do a lot of damage. Yeesh. Okay. Not bad. Not good, but not bad. Mm-hmm. I'm under a heavy bomb. I saw that. Yeah, so that uh that five skull um ouch. Five skull flashpoint that we're going to do for the last episode is a long one too, uh -huh. so it should be interesting. It should be a long episode. Got to make sure all our well as many mechs as possible are up and running for that. It's going to be at least three missions in a row, probably. Unfortunately, it's oh, see ya. Unfortunately, it's four Comstar. So, I mean, it really isn't the best in the world, but we'll take it. We will take it. All right, hammer him. Six pack. Oh, I got a question though. Oh, see ya. Told you she could take them on. Um. I got a question though, if anybody knows the answer I have no idea, but um, if a pilot, I guess we'll find out soon enough, if a pilot lays a minefield and the mech destroys his own legs like that, <laughs> she killed them all by legging them, 
Let's see if actually it's actually her kills or not, or if they're just considered destroyed by whatever other means. Because that's interesting. They should all be her kills. Mission successful. Ooh, yeah. Contract payment increased by 80%. We should cover our, uh, hopefully covers our, our damages here. We did take a fair, not a fair bit, but a, a good deal of damage. And yep, they did count as her kills. That's, that's, that's cool. All right. Um, doesn't really matter at this point. Can we complete a mech? If we can, we will. Oh, we might as well complete the Mjolnir. Unless there's anything amazing down here that we absolutely need for the next couple of episodes, which is unlikely. So after episode 120 is done, uh, I'll do probably a, re a, not a recap episode, but sort of a final episode like 121 for both series. It'll be a combined episode, so both series will have the same one. And it'll just be a comparison between the two uh, groups of mech warriors, or pilots, and all that stuff, just to see, you know, what the status was. Oh, our mounts. Sorry, but we're going to take the arm mounts. I think we can get these in before uh, we do the final battle. I'm sure we can. All right. A few parts. No big deal. Ooh, we did we get our, yeah, we got our Mjolnir part. All right. This is what we really wanted, though. All right. 184,000. So that's less than what we made. That's good. 20 days for repairs. It's easy. All right, let's take that second mission now. So yeah, that last episode, 121, will just be a recap. We'll have a look at the pilots, uh, number of missions, uh, number of kills, number of um, uh, days with the company. We'll kind of just do a comparison to see who was the better between uh, Night Witches and uh, Falcon Freeborn. Um, and uh, pay our respects to the pilots that died in these two series because uh, it's the first... Uh, two series that I've played where pilots have actually died. So, yeah. Um, let's have a look here. Contracts. And we're going to jump in and letter of mark, denial of destruction. Uh, let's go this route. It's better payout overall. And there might be reinforcements. Okay, so take out the main lance. And let's bring our secondary lance in. Hannibal the cannibal. Uh, Gocho, Judge, and Avalanche. And we're going to run the catapult. I want to see how it runs. The two Mad Dogs and the Screamer. Now the Screamer's got a different loadout. Um, we got two medium approved heavy lasers, an ATM-6, and a pair of ER micro lasers. Now the ATM's got HEMO2, so we got to be in close to use this guy. Um, but with the jumping and stuff, we should be okay. Now it runs a little hot, so we'll have to be careful of what we do with this guy. Um, just to see how it plays out here. Uh, and now this one should be the one with the extra ATM, and it's not. So we switched these two around. I should really rename these guys, but I did not. This one should have the six and the three, right? Yeah. Okay. So let's deploy this and get it done. All right. Here we go. Capture base just up ahead. All right. In this base. Nice. Uh, let's just get you walking up here. Uh, no, let's get up close. As fast as we kind of can. Uh, and let's switch these out from Thunder to Artemis just to start. So my biggest fear with the new Rotec um, is that um, uh, you know once they get it um, playable and people are, are playing it and stuff, they'll change it somehow, which will cause it to break saves. Um, and I've had that happen in the past where I've kind of gotten into a series and um, 
you get to a certain point and then they, they release a version that breaks saves and then it's like, I got to continue along with that version. So that's my biggest fear. Because the starting of this is going to require a lot of work before I can even get to a, the first bit of recording. Um, it's going to be a really tough um, sniper artillery. Heavy sniper turret. Ugh. Kitusha. I think we need this turret first. Yeah, so I'm just kind of terrified that that's what happens. So I may wait. Once it comes out, I, I may wait a little bit before I commit to starting to play because like the for me, just setting it up the beginning um, is going to take quite a long time. For what I want to do. What can I, do for you? I think this cat Yusha needs to know what it's like to be an LRM mech. And firing. Well, you're our scout, so time to scout. Enemy contact. Arrow chassis. Flee. That's a full jump and firing everything. That's actually not that bad. It's a lot less than I thought it was going to be. So let's leave the micros off because we don't need it on this guy, I don't think. Can't kill him anyway. Yeah. Uh-huh. Okay, that's a Thunderbolt turret. Yeah, that's a Thunderbolt. Arrow's got to go first. They must have a vehicle back here somewhere. They got two guys we haven't seen yet. Waiting on you, Commander. Sprinting. Okay, what do we got over here? Enforcer. An assassin. Okay, not bad. Let's take this turret out. Oh. Not working. It's not. What do we got? Oh, is that the flea? It is. Moving out. Might as well multi it. Putting fire. Ah. Just need a few hits back here. Come on. Ah, crap. Really. Can you finish this guy up for me? Probably. Okay, nice. That turret is gone. It's gone. What do you need? Got enough for vigilance? Perfect. Understood. Now let's see how, what the heat does if we just run. Oh, it just drops like crazy. Throw up the micros. Oh yeah, man. Let her rip. Ooh. <laughs> I love that laugh. Look at this thing. Shredded. Alright, that's all of us. Let's see what they got. Enforcing an assassin. I'm, the most thing the thing I'm worst worried about the most is a Thunderbolt turret, but I don't think it's a uh, Thunderbolt um um, 
20, I think it's just a 10. Either way, though, I mean, 10 still got, what, up to 75 damage or 65 damage or something? It's still pretty heavy. Ooh, all right. Somebody's angry. Man, I remember the first version of Rogue Tech. Those guys were always so scary. They were always accurate, like always so accurate. Here we go. Let's get some evasion going. Yeah, yeah, fired all. That was a, a short jump. Ooh, see ya. How did that taste? Now, I don't know if he died. Sounds like he died. Standing by. Thought there for a second we didn't kill him, but just uh, destroyed his arm and then he disappeared. Let's get on this assassin. On my way. Where he should be in HE range. We certainly are. Let's warlord this. See if we can take this guy out quick. We're going to put everybody else on this guy. Don't worry about the flea. Chances are you're not going to kill that turret, so you might as well shoot this guy. Got it. Oh, he's going to take it, but he ain't going to like it. He said like a thousand times already. Alright, hammer him. Have a seat. Some heavy That's going to hurt. So I hope we get one of these screamers in the next series. If I can find one of those missions for a land air mech, I'll go after one of those. But it's got to be within the range, like the range that we're playing in, though, like the area. Be kind of cool if we had like a full lance of those guys. Move order received. Trash him. Removed. Finishing move. Gonna need to move more than that, buddy. Inflicted some heavy damage. Um, yeah, go normal. Okay, I don't have to worry about that now. We might have enough time to do one more mission after this, if we can kill these guys quick. Actually, can you, uh... Sure! I feel sorry for this flea, but... What is one to do? <laughs> tango down. Tango spread halfway across the map. That's what that tango is. Ah, I just rained some shiz on him. He's got too much in the legs. Just fire. All right, stripped his armor pretty much. Ah. Not a bad loadout. Losing armor. Except the fact that he runs way too hot. It's go time. Moving to position. Destroy, destroy all Comstar forces. Let's just remove this guy. 
That's what I'm talking about. Alright. Let's just get in here so we can see the buildings. Oh yeah, we got targets now. Yep, hammer this building. We should be able to take it down. Oh yeah. Need four buildings. Got it. Medium. Hundred and fifty, eh? Anything with a hundred? Oh wait, that one's got a hundred. Let's just shoot that one. Just so well, we could fire everything, really. Really. We could fire everything, really. Copy that. Nice. Done. What's next? The screams. The screams. You betcha. Not gonna be able to take both, but uh -huh. we hit them both. See ya. Oh, did we not get it? We must have missed with a missile. Waiting for orders. Aha, you still get to go though. There you are. There it is, folks. Okay, contract payment increased by 35%. We didn't take too much damage, though, so I'm not really that worried. All right. Let's have a look here. Uh, get three parts. I don't think there's really much we want here. Oh, TTS Energy. I'll take that. Um, Seven hundred and ten thousand for that. Yeah, let's just take that. And that. Sure. Alright. Ah, uh, nice. 45 in only four days. Cool. So, let's have a quick look here. Um, we got one day of the financial report, which is fine. I'm going to take that last mission, I think. Because these ones were really easy. Well, relatively easy. And we'll take letter of mark. Most likely to be two lances. Let's accept this. And then what we'll do is we're going to take... Um, let's take uh, Griff and Mockingbird. Because they're the most resistant to, da to uh, pilot fatigue. And then these two. I'm sure these two will take an injury for this. But not much we can do about that. And we've only got... Well, we've got four mechs that we haven't used... Well, not that we haven't used, but let's take this one, this one, uh, this one. Oh, we've got the, uh, this guy too. Sure, let's go this route. We haven't used these four mechs today yet, so let's go for it. Okay. Well, this gives me bad feelings. That's not a mech, is it? No. Alright, well. We got the range, so. Not too worried about getting close to anybody. Standing by. Rolling. Got a ton of long range weapons on these guys. Ready for order. Location confirmed. Any luck though, hey. we can stay silent enough that they won't uh, spot us right away and we can just pick them off from a distance. Okay. I'm picking up a new sensor trace. Looks like, like enemy reinforcements. We've got an unknown on sensors. Well, they ain't shooting at us. Order? 
Let's shoot this guy. Alright, a little bit of a start. They don't shoot at us, then Rakshasa, okay. Really? Really, I turned so that I would be able to see him. Well, at least we got one large laser hit. Maybe we can pull that Spectre out of the battle, if we get lucky. Cram. Vehicle. Zephyr SRM-2. Archer. Cool. Commander. Well, ER small even can range. This is fire. Wow. What? We cut the tag on him and he blew up. Down. That tag is devastating. Tag, you're dead. And a blackjack. Okay. One more guy on the left here that we haven't seen yet. Okay, let's go. All right, let's hammer this guy. All right, two hits and a tag, nice. Pegasus, okay. He's gonna spot us. Oh, well, maybe not. Yeah, they see us. AMS working overtime. 13 from 20 hits, nice. Yeah, I'm looking forward to, to uh, new mech loadouts and new mechs and stuff in the next uh, series. It's going to be tough when we first start, that's for sure. I mean, we'll have a bit of an advantage at the start. I'm not going to reveal everything uh, too much to you. We'll have a bit of an advantage, but it's going to be really, really difficult after a bit. Hopefully we can pick up some mechs relatively quickly. Oh. Crunch back. He's got no armor. He's got no armor. That's probably why the Spectre died. Well, I mean, they were weakened units, right? So... So this is round three. Let's see how fast. Let's see if we can take him down in like three rounds. What no? What no? Let's put some in the side of this guy. If we can. Ooh, there goes the leg. Maybe things are looking up. Pretty much seals his fate for the next turn. Alright, let's just shoot this guy and get him out of here. Oh, not quite enough, eh? Alright. Ah, that's alright. We'll figure it out. Still got two guys left to go. Now, was that the archer that moved over here before? No, it wasn't the blackjack. Blackjack's not a range from there? What's the 1 dB? If it's got inner sphere pulse lasers, I can understand it not being a range. 
But if it's got AC2s or large lasers, it should be in range. Or if it's the medium, it could be the medium laser flamer version or whatever it is. That's a possibility as well. Now, do we get eyes off? Oh, we can kill this guy. How much has he got in the front? 72. They had two front shots. Although this guy is probably the better deal. Let's go full warlord on this guy. Not you. You. And firing. Yes, four hits. Nicely done. Okay, let's try and finish this guy up. Uh, let's Warlord this. I want the extra damage. And firing. Yes. I don't really care. I don't really care. We're just here to kill shit and drink beer. I'm missing an AMS on that thing. I might be. Waiting for orders. Two PPCs and swarm, eh? Okay, let's do this. Um, Moving to position. Let's try and kill this guy. Firing. There we go. Enemy down. I wanted the CT, but I'll take the right torso. That's fine too. Whatever. Whatever scratches them from the map. Okay, we got this round and next round to see if we can clean these guys up. I think these two at the back, the blackjack and the archer will be hard, but the other three should be okay. The two vehicles and the crab should go down quick, I think. If these guys are only have like quarter, oh yeah they do, quarter armor. Blackjack will drive pretty quickly, I think. Just the range that's the issue. Come on. Twenty nine, eh? A little better on this guy. See, he's got Artemis with arrows and he hasn't really fired yet. We could kill the Zephyr. Once again, we need two hits in one location, though. Pegasus. Yeah, same thing. Crab. Let's hammer the crab. Well, that was a good choice. Okay, nice. Alright, let's do this. I want to see how good of a pilot she really is. Here it comes. Ooh, almost. Oh, almost. Bet, that hurt. Bet you did too. Hey. Hey. Can you get that crab for me? I think you can. Damn peeps on there. This might hurt. See ya. Game over. Hate to steal Mockingbird's kills, but we gotta get eyes off, so we're gonna split fire this next turn. Oh, he's finally coming with some missiles. Oh no, he might. That's right, he fired before. He fired on, uh. Yeah, that's right. 
Let me know what I was thinking. He fired on Mockingbird. I guess because I didn't see the mech, I just saw the missiles coming. I didn't associate it with the archer for some reason. Which is kind of stupid. Just the only mech back there with missiles. So, yeah, he's got largest. We have one guy left to go. I guess we all went already. No, I thought we had the Timberwolf still left. Oh, well, that's right. She went first. Never mind. Yeah, Commander. All right. Let Mockingbird take those guys on and just move into here. Let's work on this Blackjack. I'm gonna Warlord this. And firing. Okay, nice strip of armor. Take that. Is he going down? No. Huh. Got all of them. Beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah, Mockingbirds are like the only um, named pilot left in this lance. Which is kind of sad, but she was pretty fantastic at the beginning of the game with that uh, Grinner, which then morphed into the uh, Atticus. And then with the Black Cat, the one before this one, she was doing a pretty good job too. Commander? Yeah, you gotta move first. Okay. This particular mech itself is pretty deadly too. Two PPCs, two larges, two ER smalls, all firing without any heat loss. One down. Oh. All right. All right, Mr. Griff. Focus on this blackjack, see if we can get him out of here. Oh, come on. You'd think as the commander of the unit, Griff would like be one of the most devastating shots, but nah, not really. Yeah, I didn't put an AMS on the black hat. Huh. I think I was hoping for a laser AMS, but uh, we didn't really have one at the time. I don't think we have one now either, so. This is firing this guy. Okay. Come on, hit him once. Yeah, oh, twice. Nice. Hit, yeah, he's almost done. He's still coming forward, though. He's got no arms. You're brave, buddy. What's up, boss? You are brave. Uh, now we need you back here. Can you? Here we go. Gonna multi. B is gonna take the LRM. Everything else to A. Multiple targets confirmed. Nice hit. Come on, finish him up. Yeah. Critical hit, commander. Or destroy heat sink. That works too. Gonna put Mockingbird next. I think she can probably finish the vehicle up and that blackjack. We're like one round past where I thought we would be. Unless that vehicle goes behind cover. I would, I just go behind here. Nope. <laughs> sure, buddy, you just hang out right there. All right, let's put these two on B, put these three on B, and fire. Copy that, Commander. 
There we go. Oh, there you go. Double kill. All right, Giant, I'll give you first shot at this guy. Oh, you don't even need to move. Just shoot him. Just shoot him. All right, move down where he can't see you. Advancing, I guess. Griff will be here to soak up the damage. And... Yep. Oh, two large laser hits. Nice. Yeah. Oh, well. Let's see what he does. Yeah, he can't see us now. Alright, Griff. Finish him up. Last bit of swarm ammo. That's all you can use? I guess he moved out of your DLS. Alright. It's fine here. Yeah, fire. Nope. Not today. Have a seat, though. Oh. Gonna steal the kill, aren't you? Might as well. Let's get rid of them. There we go. Cleaned up the Comstar menace on this planet. Nice. Mission successful. All right, there it is, 68,000. That should cover our damages. Wow, Mockingbird. Okay. As I was saying, she was doing okay, but she loves this black cat, I gotta say. Gotta say. All right. Anything here we can get to finish off a mech? Not really. Anything good down here? Not really. A couple of cores we could probably sell. Just so we can make our financial report and affect repairs, I would, I'd imagine. Yeah, any good ammo? Not really. Okay, let's take the two cores. We'll just sell them. Uh, there's no... Oh, fire control system energy. Oh, we don't need that. Alright, let's confirm. Yeah, a bunch of stuff. Ah, 49,000. Five days. So that's actually pretty reasonable. So between episodes, we're going to jump systems. I'll sell a bunch of stuff here. And we're pretty darn close to um, being able to hit up this before the end of its expiry. We've got 33 days. So we'll jump to another system really close by. Pull off some missions for episode 119. Then episode 120, we'll jump over there. Run a long... Uh, long... Um... um flashpoint there and we'll, that, that episode will be however long it takes us to finish that flashpoint we'll just go the whole thing and then uh, at the end of that that'll be the end of uh, Falcon Freeborn and then we will do one more episode after that 121 which will be a collection of um, comparison between Falcon Freeborn and Night Witches. Now it won't be a 100% fair comparison because we had I think 7 episodes or 8 episodes in Night Witches that were in um, 997. Then when I upgraded to 998, I had to restart the whole thing all over again. So there's a seven episode difference. But I'm not going to be really worried about that. I'm going to be looking at the number of missions the pilot's taken versus number of kills, number of wounds, things like that. And we'll put up a list and we'll uh, compare all the better pilots to see uh, which of the two series. I'm interested to see the difference between Mockingbird and uh, Megasaur and which one performed better. Uh, Megasaur is getting a lot of kills now <laughs> every episode. Just pretty much every mech she attacks, she kills now in each turn. So, um, yeah, we'll have to see how that goes, all right? So, I'm going to leave the episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. Once again, I apologize for the delay between episodes. Um, wasn't my intention for it to be that long, but uh, I did, I did, like I said, I did need to take a little bit of time off just to take a bit of a break. All right, so, uh, yeah, leave the episode here. Uh, if you enjoyed it, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And you can drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.